cow inkling. a lot of combo potential. Yeah, and DVD's especially... a heavyweight. Yeah, I was about to say, especially against a heavyweight like DDD. Inkling also has a lot of really good movement, which I think would be good against DDD. Yeah. Penguin getting all inked up the bomb, colliding with the Gordo. It looks like it does send the Gordo back out lower. Yeah. Kinda of scary. Can't hold shield. Ooh. Uh, yep, that covers the roll. <laughs> Hitboxes. Covers jump, covers neutral get up, covers the roll. If you're far back enough, covers uh get up attack. Well you can if you time it right, you can kick it back. But it's kinda of scary. Oh. oh, just the frame. Oh, it looks like him. Penis man with the big balls. Yeah, right there. He was just too scared to do anything. Yep. That, that, time, that time he didn't wait. He didn't want to repeat. At least run the damage, if not kill. But that was definitely going to kill. 100%. Oh, Poob definitely trying to like use his Gordos to keep yep. Link back. Yeah, I know. He has a really good control of the ledge right now. And you yeah, can't just hang there because the Gordo will get you if you're on the ledge and you have that invincibility. Yeah. And so true with like the puff from above him. Makes it so Ooh, good snipe. Makes it so Inkling can't just like jump. Just like get up jump. Yeah. Because it can't land on deity platform. Well even if the Gordo's just hanging over the ledge and Inkling jumps, then he'll get hit. Yeah. Why if anyone jumps? A lot of bombs colliding. They want to throw their stuff at the same time. Hey, these these scores are really, really good. Oh! Scary. Yep. Every time this happens to me, every time a DDD pulls out a jet hammer, your brain just melts, and you're like, uh, what do I do? So you try and do something, and then DDD just pop. You're just like, that. ooh, bright light, must follow it. Yeah. So if you want to call us Pokemon Lee, uh, or, is that, or is that like to call it the stage of edge guarding? Yeah. <laughs> and tell me. Right? Yeah. Because it gives it gives like it gives their coverer more options to recover with the platform above. It also makes like puts them in a more difficult spot if they're trying to recover off, off ledge. Yeah. At the same time, it's a big stage where Gord I mean GDD can run back to Gordos. I don't think Inkling's gonna use it. Well, there's a lot, there's a lot of spot bomb and Gordo colliding in this matchup. Yeah. I think, yeah, they just want to throw stuff at the same time. Oh, going for a back air. Yeah, Kel with a good advantage here. Yeah. But he doesn't want to get sent to ledge and space out again. Oh no, he's on ledge! No, he got that. No! Back. This bad position. Ooh, the Gordo. He just got hit by the Gordo, not Jack yeah. Hammer. <laughs> See, like, like, this is what I mean, like... Look, platform's covered, and then yeah. the ledge is covered. You can't neutral get up, you can't... Yeah, this you can't is, jump up, get up. This is not the stage. The only yeah. thing you can really do is, like, get up attack, and you're just too intimidated to do that. Yeah, because it has super armor. Well, oh, no. those were the close. Yeah. Oh! Wow. She moves right in. Again, hitbox. Yeah. <laughs> Ink roller does not beat. And don't get up. There you go. He's just getting spaced out. He's been on ledge 90% of the game. And jab. Not quite killing. He did the jab reset. Just give that little ticket knockback that still connects him to that smash. Kind of guarantees that he will just kind of fall out of it instead of fly out of it. Ooh, 
the upper, not quite killing. He did it out 180 percent. Yeah. Oh, jet hammer. No. No. Oh, super super armor. armor is disgusting. DDD is disgusting. Wait, did you just say super armor is disgusting? You're gonna hate King K roll. But yeah, I do hate King K roll, but for yeah. Also, I hate Little Man. How can they gotta give him super armor to all the low tiers and they're still bad? <laughs> um, anyway, poop with a uh, stock up. Yeah, Kel having a really bad time playing against. Like, DDD is one of those matchups where you have to figure him out. I don't think he hasn't figured out. He's panicking a lot, but yeah. getting punished for it. Although the, old, the roller is really working in these situations. That was a good combo, the roller to drag down up air up air. Yeah, and one thing you can do is like, when he... Wow. Yeah, you can't get up attack that. Um, he, he rolls. Still in, it's best still in Oh, it's, it's already semis? Okay. Oh, dang. Uh... Dang, that went by fast. Guess there wasn't as many people here. Yeah. First week of Saturday weekly. Yeah. And I went 0-2. I went 0-2 oh. Saturday. No way. Now we can go play friendly or commentate. Yeah. Uh, Piranha Plant purchase and cleaning. Uh, so instead of spiky balls flying in his face, oh no, there's still gonna be spiky balls flying in his face. Yeah. Should we end? Yeah. Just throwing your face at the opponent's face works every time. What other characters do that? Uh, Pikachu and Pichu, side B, and dash yeah. attack. Um, Piranha Plant's like entire body in his face. So, this is another one of those matchups so it can be really frustrating that you have to kind of take time to learn. Yeah. I feel like a lot of, like, against like Community, a lot of Inkling's just, like, approaches would just stop Gordos in their tracks. Although, yeah. he did have a really good ledge, ledge game against Inkling. Although, I think Inkling's hitboxes are kind of small, which makes it hard to hit him back as opposed to, like, Lucina, who has an entire sword. Yeah. Like, Poop does have a lead here. Piranha Plant all linked up on the other side of the stage. Ooh, not quite that. Send him off stage. Can he edge guard? Oh, was... oh, okay, there we go. He's not dead because Piranha Plant can head out. Just between. Yeah, look at that. Real Simon Richter hours of side B neutral B. He hasn't down beat once, which I yeah. feel like. Be scary. Ooh, rolls into it. Thank okay. Kel taking the first set. That was I mean, a good read. The first game. Yeah. I feel like Prom Plant's best moves are either are just his neutral B and down B. Uh yeah. And his like up tilt, not fair. Yeah. Side uh, B gonna be good. Up smash is probably like his best killing option. Yeah. He, other guys. Like it's not true, but you can do drag down there up smash. But people don't expect it. I think that's what he's fishing for. Yeah, uh, let's send him out. Oh. Still getting hit by the grounded rollers. Yeah. I'm kinda getting punished for it, too. He did some damage, but some off stage, but wasn't able to capitalize on the stage control. Oh, and Nair's coming out here. Nair's, a, Nair's another one of Prime Plant's good moves. Yeah, and Porter. Back air, uh, no. Ooh, just barely the little tooth of the plant missing. But spike ball was plant hitting. When you find oh, that the like tea bag, the little oh, plant pop. Wow, how dare you? Oh, and the bomb not quite getting it. It's just when you when you find that perfect it. range where probably, like a projectile bounces off the side of the stage and then off to Ooh. off the stage, and that, that's pretty much like your best edge guarding option. Yeah, but Kel not quite getting that. He went for the big range play. That would've been really cool to get it, but now he's getting ledge guard. Still has the advantage going for the roller, just barely shield. Yeah, it's kind of hard to do roller that far distance, but you do get the staging cut, which doesn't last very long. I feel like it should last a little bit longer, even though each wing's already really good. Back air, taking stage, Kel with the stock lead. Yeah. And some good percent. Let's see uh, if he can get some more percent before he dies. 
the yep. YouTuber on point may not have been like the best decision here. I mean, he was already winning with. Uh, yeah, he just likes the, the, to play characters. Just like, just like to flex. Not really flex. He just doesn't want to like. He gets bored of like tryharding, if that makes sense. Especially with DDD. Yeah. Kind of hates DDD now. I'm mean, like, what all I really do is just spam Gordos. Yeah, he probably felt gross about the edge guarding. So yeah. He went, went. <laughs> Probably heard a commentating, just like, oh my gosh, I'm such a terrible person. Sometimes you can feel that way. Yeah, that's why he dropped Isabel. <laughs> that's why he dropped Isabel. But Cal, not feeling gross right now, hoping to lead and taking the game with a good, a very yeah. good read. Two on two, let's see where. Oh. Are we gonna see the plant stay or the DDD pick? I don't know. I'd probably think DDD, because it'd probably be a safe to soften option. Or, you know, maybe he just wants to get more practice in with uh, Prompt Man. We are going back to 2 DDD. Really realizing that he needs to be more safe. Just go with what he knows will work. Alright, Nova, I kind of forgot the stage existed and it's back on the rule set. Yeah. Oh, he's hopping. Yeah, he's see, hopping. it's kind of like. I think Queen has like hop. small hitboxes that you kind of have to like space it really well to hit the Gordos. But he did go DDD again. Lens the roller, just back air. Ooh, nice jab. No, Not Kel, only is he Kel really taking, yeah. Kel really taking advantage of his, all of his combos against his heavy. Uh, now he's just pairing the Gordos. DDD all inked up. Kinda. Who did a good job of while he was all inked up, kinda spacing him out with Gordos, kinda making it scary for him to approach to deal more percent while he's inked. Kel making a Kel making a good effort to make sure that he doesn't get punished for his rollers. Yeah, he's been a lot smarter about them, and he hasn't been off stage. Did I speak too soon? Yeah, yeah I know. <laughs> he's getting edge guarded. And what do you do there? You sh move past. Goes deep. Oh, hits him with the up. He's scary. Where this really yeah. both like kill percent. Even oh, goes for the down smash, trying to two frame, but not quite getting it. Now DDD is the one off stage, but he can still throw Gordos and create that pressure. Using using the suck to land was a pretty good idea. Yeah. So he couldn't he couldn't really uh, advance. Sort. And he's grounded. The jab? Four what? tail. Oh, four tail. tail. Okay. <laughs> I guess he really didn't have much time left in that yeah. round. Could have also been a nice play you decided to order just high kill, but didn't want to stay on the board smash. Ooh, Ooh Jet I feel like good. I would have done a lot more shield pressure. But all wow. pinked up again. I'm like a pink penguin. Pretty pink. Going pink for pink another roll in. Thanks. Pretty pink penguin. Pretty pink squid. A penguin versus squid, who has the Arctic, Arctic type advantage? Oh, the penguin does. That, that, that's a big hammer. Or oh, <laughs> when you give a penguin a hammer. <laughs> Stop! Hammer time. That's what DDD does on ledge. It's always hammer time when DDD's around. Yeah, is he the only one? I feel like there's another character with a hammer. Kirby? Kirby? Huh. I mean, Joker has a gun. That's yeah, <laughs> he does. And yep, he's gonna do the jab up smash. It's even. Kyle has to get in and do those combos. Yeah, there we go. Wow, that, that, oh, that was... misses the upper up air. Yeah, though he has a lot of character knowledge. He knows like what to go for with all these grounds. Yeah, he's also. Oh, it six. looks like he's figured out the matchup a lot. He's able to get in a lot more and not be like scared of the Gordos. Yeah. 
Although, ledge is still... He still has a big disadvantage on the ledge, because... Oh, that's scary. Here yeah, we go. Just, it, it just, like, scares you, because, like, how much shield damage is that really going to do? Yeah, it was a big hammer in your face. I just can see a hammer flinging at that your face. a very good advantage. Throws the bomb. Pooba's really trying to get in with like those nares. Yeah, a lot of nares. Oh, there we go. That's it. That. Yep. Right. Two, two. Game five. So this is the last game. Honestly, I could see Pooba being pretty thrown off at this point, because he's gone back to the character that he was winning with and lost. Like, kinda... Uh, we're gonna see how much Pooba wants to win. Yeah. With his character picks. He's gonna go. He's going game and watch. Return alter. Yik Dreisel. Yik Dreisel. No, I have a video of Finn saying it. Let say it. This is how you say it. Or from our lovely video. Oh, he is going DD. Okay. Kind of scary. So we're going DD and Inkling again on Yik Dreisel's alter. Three, two, one. I was trying to go for the strong lead. Wow. Right. Who's first attack was rolling over while ducking? Yeah. That's up tilt. No, it's not. It's uh, down tilt. Down tilt. Just a, a stylish duck. The, um, what's that? Who else has a move like that? Roll, roll, roll. roll. I don't know. Diddy. The Skororos go fast, but they haven't done anything up with the bomb. Yeah. Cal's just using them to space out, maybe they'll get lucky, kind of like when you're playing Wii Fit and you just kind of hit their ball back, and maybe they'll do something cool. Almost getting that roller if they would have kept going, maybe. I, I'm not sure if he jumped. Pretty interesting is that sometimes there's just like platforms all over the stage. So it makes it so you can't like jump too high or else you get stuck by platforms. You get from bad yeah. position. It's also weird how the platforms go up. Like, that can create some interesting stuff. And Kale taking the first stock with another roller jab up smash. Or is it F tilt? Does the jab, is the jab the gun? Or does he kind of punch first? I don't know. Like, just trying to dash in the gun. Yeah, you, he's really looking for a way in, which is yeah. something you gotta do for DDD. Because DDD doesn't have a lot of options. He has like Nair. Really good at covering his bases. Yeah. But not a lot of options in disadvantage. So he's really waiting for that opportunity where maybe Poop gets uh, impatient or just runs off of the border. But where he gets impatient, he just kind of looks for options other than Porto. Like right there, he did do Chubby. Which has a lot of ending lag. Kind of getting zoned out. The paint. Kel could take this. He's playing very well today. He beat Day, who was a top 10 player. So is Poop. These are both top 10 players. Oh, I'm going for the jab lock. Not quite getting it. Kel. Kel's a different lead. It's like so, sometimes in situations like this, it can be like pretty interesting to see what <gasps> players will do. Try to catch up. That was good. Held the whole lead. Oh. Uh, yep, platforms allow you to attack. Change your combos, and that's why I go FD every game. Ooh. Ooh. Every time PD pulls out Jet Hammer and you do an option wow. without realizing it, your gut kind of drops. And sometimes. Sometimes, you sometimes things it. like It's like sometimes you just look like a genius and you play it off, you know? Yeah. Raquel playing this well, he probably is a genius. But now he's off stage. Oh Another gosh, I remember. Oh, what, what was that? Uh, was that neutral get up and he just 
I blew you into like. <laughs> what even was that? What did he like? It, it, it's five minutes IQ, you can't comprehend. He was invincible, he went right through it. But I'm not sure if you have invincibility frames on your show get up. Ooh, just. Yeah, dash that can two frame because it lasts like six frames and it's really gross and it sends out and it kills. But, yeah, he's off stage. What do you do? You don't do that one. He tried to put. Oh, he tried to push the Gordo back into him, but mistimed it. Yeah. But now he gets his revenge and pushes Gordo back in. Just kinda needs to look for a kill confirm like this. That's not quite gonna kill. With the fast mashing, with the Nair strings. Oh, just gone for four there. Uh, there we go. Ooh, no. That was... This is a turnaround, yeah. Yeah, that was actually. Probably feeling like spaghetti. He's landed two rollers and hasn't gotten anything off of them. GDD land over there. Scoop. Looking for it. Going off stage. Swipe Definitely off. trying to be like. To be defensive. Yeah. He's like going. He's trying to go around Kel. And that's the game. That's the game. Wow, Kel beating Boop. 3 2. Nice. Dang. Close game. Boop. I mean, Kel's popping off. Kel's popping off.